All right, uh, let's look at the homework 3.10, uh, problem number two. All right, so we want to find the linearization of uh, this function at uh, x equals zero. All right, so uh, let's do that first. All right, so uh, first uh, we want to find f of zero. So f of zero would be uh, square root of uh, one minus zero, which is going to be square root of one, so it's gonna be one. All right, so let's take the derivative. Um, you know, I don't like the square root, so I'm going to write it as quantity 1 minus x raise it to the 1 half power. Alright, so if we take the derivative of uh, f, we get, I right, put uh, 1 half in front, and the quantity, save the quantity x my, uh, 1 minus x, subtract 1 from the 1 uh, power, so it's negative 1 half, then multiply by derivative inside, which is negative one. All right? So this is going to be uh, negative uh, one over two square root of one minus x. All right? So let's find f prime of a, in this case a is zero. So it's a negative one over square root, uh, two times square root of one. So it's just going to be negative one half. All right, so the linearization is going to be, um, uh, so therefore, L of x is equal to uh, f of x is 1 uh, minus 1 half uh, x minus 0. So that's going to be just x. All right, so this is the linearization. All right, so what we want to do is uh, we want to find uh, approximation. So square root of 0 0.9 is exactly the same thing as f of uh, 0 0.1, right? Because if you put the 0 0.1 here, 1 minus 0 0.1 is 0 0.9, so it's a square root of 0 0.9, which means that, that this is can be approximated by the linearization at the same point, right? So this is going to be 1 minus 1 half times 0 0.1, right? So this is just a 1 minus 0 0.05, which is going to be 9.95. Actually, no, 0 0.95. I meant 0 0.95, all right? And how about the square root of uh, 0 0.99, which is exactly the same thing as f of 0 0.01 which can be approximated by L of 0 0.01, all right? Which is going to be one minus one half times 0 0.01, which is uh, one minus 0 0.005, which is going to be 0 0.99, let's see, 995. All right, so uh, let's type it in, all right? Oops, so that's not it. All right. So the function is uh, negative one half. Uh, well, maybe I'll write it as uh, one minus. All right, uh, one half x. All right. Then we got this one is a zero point nine five, and we got the zero point nine nine five. All right. Then uh, let's see. Oops. Let's look at the, um, so illustrate the graph uh, by line. Okay, so graph, square root of one minus x would be, let's see, so we have, the, okay, so they have the same graph. Uh, let's see here and there. Uh, actually, it's a little bit different, so let's uh, we have to be careful. So x-intercept is gonna be one, so that's not it, and this is not it. And this is, uh, actually, this is the only one that's reasonable, so I have to pick that, because everyone else, uh, has a wrong x-intercept. All right, so let's double check. Submit for testing. All right, I came back and then we got uh, all these guys correctly. All right, that's it. I hope that uh, this was clear.